this afternoon we went um, to a ground blind called the pipeline because there is a gas pipeline that was cut through that area so it was nice and open on uh, to, to my left and to my right and it's probably about I don't know a 20 meter section that was cut for miles I didn't really have a whole lot of expectations because when I do that I seem to not um, get a deer it just seems that's the way it is but we weren't there very long maybe 30 to 40 minutes and we saw the first deer it was a doe he came in and uh, she was there for probably 20 minutes just hanging out eating and um, so I kind of uh, was relaxing there a little bit Um, probably about 20 minutes later, 25 minutes later, um, that's when the big buck came in and he brought about four to six does in with, with him. It's the biggest white tail I've ever seen. That is amazing. They asked me earlier, what was my expectations? I didn't have any. That right there would have exceeded all of my expectations. That is amazing. That is freaking amazing. <laughs> when, I, when I saw that buck, I knew that that's the one that, I mean, I wanted to take him. He was, he was, I mean, it's my first buck period, but he was, way bigger than anything I had anticipated. We wanted to make a sight for a shotgun in the new Lightwave design, and um, it, it worked awesome. I mean, it's, it did everything that we expected it to do. It does such a great job of gathering light that, I mean, the sight was extremely bright, um, very easy to see, and it worked very well. It should be over here. He couldn't have went far. He's running right down. We shot him right there. Looking for some blood. Oh, there he is. He didn't even get in the bushes. <laughs> Dang. Look at the size of that sucker. Oh my God. Yes. Oh. Very, very nice. Look at that, man. How cool is it to see a guy like Scott who's, who's you know, been dreaming of a moment to kill a good buck and, you know, he's had some bad breaks out there that, and he hadn't been able to get one, come in and knock one down in the manner he did, you know, and take it with a shotgun slug. I just, I don't know. That, to me, that gives me goosebumps. And when I get the text and I get the phone call that we've got success, can you come help us pick it up? Can you come load it? I mean, to me, that's a successful day. Well, congratulations, Scott, on your entry into the Yamaha Whitetail Diaries.